The Eastern Kentucky University campus remains on alert today following a threat found on campus. Someone spray painted that note on a bathroom wall on campus and it was found on Sunday night. WKYT Sean Moody is live on the EKU campus now with our top story at 1230 updating us. Hey there, Bill and Barb. This is Model Laboratory School. It's on EKU's campus. It would normally be open today, but because of that threat, they've decided to go ahead and close the rest of the week. They already had the day off on Friday. There are also some other changes happening here on campus. EKU spokespeople say there are increased police patrols after the threat they found scribbled on a bathroom wall Sunday night. They've called in the FBI's Joint Terrorism Task Force as well as local police agencies to help out with their investigation. Model Laboratory School decided to go ahead and close for the rest of the week. They were already scheduled, as I said, to be off on Friday. And in a letter to the campus community yesterday, EKU President Michael Benson said he understood that some students would feel threatened and encouraged them to work out plans with their professors on a case-by-case -case basis if they felt they needed to miss class. The university has offered a $10,000 reward for information that leads to a conviction in this case, and they say that's led to some information. We think because of that reward being offered, it sends a message that we're not going to tolerate this kind of threat or anyone trying to harm people on our campuses. So we have been getting a number of calls, some information. Police are following up on every one of those, trying to determine if there is a connection and if we can identify who's responsible for this. Now, the university has also made some changes to some smaller events throughout the week. There's a Chautauqua lecture series that had been scheduled for Thursday night. They've gone ahead and postponed that one, as well as a student forum that was supposed to be last night that would talk about changes here on campus. They've postponed that as well. Live in Richmond, Sean Moody, WKYT.